guys, it's Tina. So every girl wants beautiful radiant skin and today I show you a quick easy DIY to achieve just that. All you're gonna need for this homemade facial mask is some bentonite clay, some avocado oil, honey, and some old-fashioned oats. Oats have several benefits, especially to the skin. So first we have to make the oatmeal powder. All you're gonna do is simply blend your old-fashioned oats until you get a powder. I start off by pouring about half a cup in my food processor. If you don't have a food processor, a blender will do just fine. But you want to blend this until it's almost like a powder. Oatmeal is great because it has great moisturizing properties, it helps remove dead skin cells, and it's especially good for sensitive skin too. You are only going to need about a teaspoon worth of the oatmeal powder but you can store the rest for easy access when next you need it. So we're ready to begin. All you're gonna need is one teaspoon of bentonite clay, which helps remove excess oils, dirt, and impurities. And then also one teaspoon of your ground oats. Add about half a teaspoon of avocado oil, which will help smooth and nourish your skin to give you that young, vibrant skin we all love. Then, another half a teaspoon of honey, which moisturizes and gives you really nice, soft and supple skin. Measure out about a quarter cup of warm water and add to your mixture in small quantities at a time. You just want to mix it to get a nice, thick paste. Keep adding the water slowly, but if you do add too much, then you can always add a little bit more of your bentonite clay to kind of thicken it up like I did here. Once you have your mask all ready with that thick paste-like consistency, the next thing you want to do is simply apply it to your face. So I apply it generously all around my face, avoiding my eyes. You want to apply the mask and let it sit for about 10 to 15 minutes. As it sits, it's going to start drying out and you're going to feel your face tightening up. That not to worry, that's just the face mask working. Also, you might feel a little tingling, which is again another sensation that is normal. If it's too much tingling, then you probably want to wash your face out. However, a little tingling is pretty normal. You can often guess a woman's age by looking at her neck. So when you do apply your face mask, you want to make sure that you apply some to your neck as well because you want your neck young and youthful just like your face. I'm sexy and I know it. After about 15 minutes, I washed away the mask with warm water and this mask will tighten your skin make your pores smaller and just leave your face feeling very radiant and refreshed. So I hope you enjoyed this DIY tutorial and as always thank you for watching and stay beautiful. Bye!